Well, I promised you something brand new, something completely different from the creators of Diary of a Failed Act. My name is John Perkis, and welcome to Diary of an Act. What better than to return to the location of our very first episode in Brooklyn Heights? In the previous episodes, we revisited my past, my experiences, my mistakes, some of my failings. Remember, success is stumbling from failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. This month is the fifth month that we have been doing this series. And I have had quite a few, as I've mentioned, requests that I change the title. People were not getting the irony of the title. People were not getting the humour of the title. Some people were coming in halfway through the series, three quarters of the way through. They hadn't seen the first episode. They didn't understand why it was being called Diary of a Failed Actor. There's an energy around that title. There's a subliminal message that even though you're not perceiving it, you are receiving it. And it's reflective. Even though it doesn't actually appertain to you, it's brushing off on you. And it might even just ever so slightly be causing some people not to click on any of the episodes. Diary of a Failed Actor? Give it a new name. Give it a new start. So, we bid farewell to those early episodes and we start now with the new season and we go on new adventures and I will take you on every step of my journey from here onward. We have some very exciting new guests lined up for this new branded season. My name is John Perkis and this is Diary of an Actor.